is day four of the province-wide college strike and still no end in sight. We're going to take you to a live look right now. Uh, picketers just starting to gather around the Casaloma campus at George Brown College. Both the striking faculty and colleges say they are in contact with the mediator, but so far they are far apart on key issues and no new talks are scheduled. This strike affecting close to half a million students in Ontario. 12,000 professors and instructors and librarians remain off the job. Now, later on in the show, coming up in the next half hour, we're going to be speaking to a student. There is a student-run rally planned for the downtown core that is calling on both sides to come back to the table. That's coming up at 8.30. All right, thanks so much, Carrie. Time is 8.30. All right, uh, so the uh, college strike, of course, into its fourth day right now. There has been support, both sides in the middle for students. Well, there is a march going on at the noon hour today up at Bay and Bloor. Oh, yeah. Uh, regarding, and this, this is a students gathering in support of the faculty. And we're going to be joined by the organizer right now. James uh, Fovell is uh, in his second year of Centennial Social Service uh, Program. Uh, good morning, James. Good morning, James. Good morning, thanks for having us guys. So tell us a little bit about this march that's going on uh, and I presume it's going to end up where you are right now, Queen's Park. Yes, that's correct. Well, you know, it's to show our solidarity to our professors. Um, you know, there's some bigger issues here at stake than just the strike. Uh, you know, when academia is exploiting our professors, uh, they preach equity in the classroom, but yet, like I said, you know, to me, they're exploiting our professors. Uh, to have us stand up in solidarity, to, to show support that we're behind them 100% of the way. Um, you know, social service workers have a code of ethics, uh, a social justice, and to me, this is an injustice, and same with our, uh, same with our classmates. So this is our way to, to show our political leaders that we stand next, uh, next to our professors. Are you anticipating a large turnout? How long do you think this will go on for? Uh, well, you know what? Uh, we're going to hear an Occupy the Grounds at least at 4.30 today. Um, you know, that's what I've got it booked for. Um, like I said, this uh, originally started off as a Centennial College initiative. You know, the students in the ESSW program, ever since then, we've reached out and branched out. Um, we're here today to call on all allies. Anybody willing to support teachers and professors at the college level, please come on down. We're looking for you. Hey, James, sidebar. Go Jays, go. Yeah. <laughs> and let's go Raptors. <laughs> Thank you. All right. Uh, so once again, that's uh, today. And it starts at Bay and Bloor at noon? Yes, it starts at Bay and Bloor at 12 o'clock. From there, we're going to march down to the Ministry of Advanced Education and Training, which is down the street at the, I believe it's the McDonald block. And then we're going to be heading over here. We're going to be starting from 1.30 to 4.30. All right. Thank you very much, James. Well, talking to us from uh, the legislature building at Queen's Park this morning.